Okay, so in this video, I want to show you how I coat something like this. So what happened, I didn't do this, the boarders did it, is this is a beveled joint and this is a half a beveled joint and half a butt joint. The reason why this happened was the boarders, instead of using 54 inch board, they used 48 inch board. So they had to put what's called a belly band. So I'm actually just going to show you how I coat this with hand tools. So I use an 11 inch curved trowel and, and a 14 inch curved trowel. So this is kind of the mud consistency that I use. It's fairly thick, but just thin enough that it'll spread nice. So I lay it on like that. And I like to use trowels, um, or is it trowels? I got into an argument about that, the pronunciation, and I looked into it, and I think that one is American English, and the other one is British English. So is it, is it trowel, like rhymes with Paul, or is it trowel, rhymes with owl? Um, what do you think about that? I, I'm just going to call it trawl. Uh, so this is what I do first is I just lay it on like that and then I can do this. Take off one edge, take off the other edge. It is a few extra steps but doing that leaves a very nice, very nice finish. Okay, so this is the one that's half a butt joint, half a bevel. So I'm going to use 14 inch curved trowel. I think that the trowels are faster than using a knife, at least for me. Okay, so here's how I do around a plug, is I go like that. And then like that, I'm running out of mud here. And then I, I go like, go like that. Okay. So I still see the tape there. I'm going to add a little more mud on that joint. So lay on a little extra. And because it is kind of like a butt joint, I don't want to overload it too much. I, I'm mostly just aiming to get mud down the sides. So my plan here is I'm going to do this first and then the next day I will coat the whole thing as one joint. And I might even put another coat over top of that. So it is a lot of extra work when walls are boarded this way. And lucky me, I get to fix it up. So that's, that's basically that. Uh, again, so the next day after this is dry, I'm going to, with a flat trawl, I'm going to coat it from about there all the way to there, merge them together. And that's that.